Damn, much nervous. What you scared for? Nothing at all. You just play too damn late. I gotta go though. I'm supposed to be a daughter in the house. Well, don't come back pregnant and high like you was last night. Whatever, nigga. All right. Well, isn't it the lady of the house? Vance will be out in a second. Good. That'll give us some time. I swear, if your brother knew the way you was coming on to me, here. He would what? Remember, I knew you way before he did. I know what you want and how you want it. And I know you still want it. I don't care what you think you know about me, but what happened in the past is in the past for a reason. Keep it on the hush if you want to. You think you can bury things like a body and just get away with it? I hope nobody finds out. Get off me. I'll give you guys some time to talk. So your little sister last night. Bugged all over some guy, high as hell. Had to snatch her little ass up last night, man. Dropped her off this morning. I swear, man, she be on that vanish. Colin will be proud. So, she always was a daddy's little girl. Shit, we couldn't even call him dad. Sir, boss, Sharana, never dad. Remember I called him pops once. He almost beat the shit out of me, man. <laughs> yeah, that is funny. My ass whoop has lasted forever. Pop sure had a heavy ass fist. What's up, though, man? You called me over here. What's up? Now, what kind of business are you into now? Oh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I'm trying to be like my big brother. Well, the time is up. That sound familiar? Package came to my office yesterday. Those exact words on it. It was addressed to a Mr. Mark. I tell you, man, trouble follows you wherever you go. I'm tired of bailing your ass up. Bailing me out? Last time I checked, I wasn't the last person with Martin in his family. How you know it wasn't for you? Don't act like you don't know how to get your hands dirty either, Vance. I can wash my hands from the drugs and the dirty money. But can you wash the blood off of you? Hey, hey, hey. 
You know that wasn't my fault. I guess Bridget wasn't your fault either, huh? Come on, man, who are you talking to? Is this girl even missing? <sighs> Trouble may love following me, but death loves chasing your ass. Who's it gonna be next? <laughs> Alex. But I like my hot and sweet What's your chocolate? Maxwell Crawford These flowers supposed to do something again this time? Were you expecting an apology? Where have you been? I was at Mother's. What'd you tell her? I didn't tell her anything. I'm not stupid. But besides, you're the one that's jeopardizing this whole arrangement with your extracurricular activities, Max. I'm not jeopardizing anything. Plus, you weren't supposed to be home till later that night. And you're supposed to be my devoted husband. <sighs> Only in public, Laura. You never got with me for love and devotion. Power. You remember what that is, right? Maybe you need to be reminded what it is. This is Max. I'm on my mind. Oh, hell no. I you're not going to see that bitch. Hey, girl. Hey. God, thank you. Mm -hmm. You are a lifesaver. I see you got a new look. Mm -hmm. mm. You know I had to switch it up. <laughs> I have to say the diva that I am. Mm -hmm. So tell me, how was it working with Lydia David the other day? It was great. It was good. She's a beautiful person, mm -hmm. quite over the top, but uh, she can, you know, cross the boundaries a little bit, though. Mm -hmm. Sound like an interesting photo shoot. Mm -hmm. Very. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Enough about that. I am going over this report. That I have for my meeting next week with your soon-to-be husband. <laughs> Y'all set a date yet? Girl, no, not yet. We haven't had any wedding plans yet. You know, he's been busy with the company. Mm -hmm. But, um, I mean, I'm not upset. I can actually say I'm a little bit relieved. Why? I'm not saying I don't want to marry Vance. I'm a little nervous. I mean, weren't you nervous when you married Max? Mm. <laughs> No, I was terrified. Why? Because I didn't know if I was making the right decision or not. And then I, I did not want to be like my mother. She had four failed marriages. Four? Yes. Almost had a nervous breakdown behind it. And that last marriage, I didn't know how she was going to get through that. She was such a dog. Girl, I'm so glad that's not our testimony. Mm -hmm. We do have some good men in our lives, though. Yeah, but now with Max, I wish I came with a preview button, so I don't know what he's getting into. Is something going wrong with Max? You don't think it's another woman, do you? Chill, chill! Oh, who is it? No, it's not another woman. Oh, we just had a little disagreement, that's all. You know, he apologized, sent me flowers, and said he was never going to do that again. And you believe him? I mean, he's my husband. <laughs> for better, for worse. I mean, this for the long haul. Like, we're really good. We're doing good. We're fine. Mm. Really? Glad to hear. Yeah. What? I mean, couples argue. We just had a disagreement about, you know, him representing that creep, uh, Troy Peters. Um, yeah, Vince did say something about that. I bet it wasn't nothing good either. 
events and Troy were friends way back in the day, but somehow something happened and their relationship went sour. Now, I think, I know what, girl, I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know why. So you need to tell me about this wedding dress. <laughs> it's white. I fell in okay. love as soon as I seen it. Traditional? White, yeah. Lace, long mm -hmm. sleeves. Uh, you know, I gotta cover up my tattoos for the church. Yeah, you know how they do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want your number, cause I got what you need. What you need? I don't need nobody, cause everybody comes to comes me. To me. Yeah. Comes in different flavors. But I like mine hot and sweet What's your chocolate? What's your chocolate? Yeah. Special dark or mocha White or whipped and cream Comes in different flavors But I like mine hot and sweet What's your chocolate?